Hey everybody, it's Mackenzie back for another video for the week. Um, this week I want to talk about fighting some fatigue at work. I know that some of us get through spurts where we're just tired all the time. And some of us may have some really bad sleeping schedules because I know I'm one of them. So I just wanted to bring up some tips that maybe might help you beat that tiredness. Um, a lot of the times it can be due to stress. Um, obviously not getting enough sleep, having that poor diet, and not calculating in your lifestyle factors to try to help you beat that fatigue. Um, even if you feel like you're experiencing extreme fatigue or anything that involves not getting enough rest or anything, that might be an underlying medical condition. So if it does seem more extreme than usual, I would consult with your doctor. Um... Eat often to beat tiredness. Eat a snack, a healthy snack, every three to four hours rather than large meals less often. Think about getting up and getting some exercise. Um, exercise makes you feel less tired, which nah, doesn't make sense, but it does. Even a 15-minute walk can boost your energy and give you more energy-boosting hormones to make you feel a little bit better. And if you want to start exercising more, start with small amounts of exercise. Build it up over weeks and months until you reach a goal of 200 and a half hours of moderate intensity aerobic exercise, such as cycling, fast walking, every week. Another one is losing weight to gain energy. If your body is carrying a lot of excess weight, it can be exhausting. Um, it can also put a strain on your heart, which can also lead to many, many, many other things. Losing weight can just make you feel more energized. Apart from being healthy, the best way to lose weight is to keep it off and stay active once you do. Um, obviously, getting more sleep, sleeping well. Many people don't get the sleep that they need, so think about going to bed and getting up in the morning at the same time every day, avoiding naps, taking time to relax before going to bed. That means turning off your phone, that means turning off the TV, maybe read a book. Maybe have a conversation with someone that's in your household. Just find a way to relax. Reduce the stress out of your life to boost your energy. Stress builds up and sucks out our energy all the time. So think about adding, going for a workout, maybe try some yoga or tai chi, listening to music or reading, and spending time with friends. Talk to your friends about things and it will reduce your stress and it will give you energy. Anything that relaxes you will improve your energy. Another idea is talking therapy. Talking therapy can beat fatigue. Talking to a counselor, a cognitive behavioralist therapist, that might help. Um, maybe think about calling your doctor about that if you feel like that might be a way to improve your energy and reduce your fatigue. Cut out the ca caffeine. Caffeine is in coffee, tea, cola, energy drinks, painkillers, and herbal remedies. Try to stay off ca caffeine for a month and you will see how less tired it makes you feel. You may find that not consuming caffeine may give you headaches, which happens and cut down more slowly on the amounts that you drink. That's with anything. Anything because caffeine is also very addictive, which some of us may or may not know. So that's things that you have to cut back slowly on. Drinking less alcohol. Although a couple of glasses of wine are nice in the evening before you go to sleep, but cutting down on that alcohol before bedtime will help you get a better night's rest and have more energy. The NHS recommends that men and women should not regularly drink more than 14 units a week, which is equivalent to six pints of an average strength beer or 10 small glasses of low strength wine. Try to have several alcohol free days a week. Also a final big one, drink more water. Sometimes you might be mildly dehydrated. Drink a big old glass of water and I guarantee you it will help you beat that fatigue just a little bit because sometimes dehydration kicks in and we don't even know it. So these are just some thoughts for the week. Just a friendly reminder, baseball's back. Go Brewers and have a great week.